use by dates. We all obey them without questioning who put them there and why. Have you ever asked yourself who gets to make the judgment call about your food when it's good enough to eat and when you should throw it away? Who is the shadowy, unregulated body who decides how long we're licensed to eat the food in our own fridge? Have you ever thrown out food that was past its use-by date? Well, guess what? You might be a massive idiot. And don't worry, I'm an idiot too. Like you, I've thrown away food simply because the label instructed me to. Also, I am you. No, I haven't time travelled like the box office smash feature film Tenet. I'm just doing this voiceover at a later date. We throw away food almost every day that's gone past its use-by date. But are we throwing away food unnecessarily? And have we been leaving too much flavour on the table? It's estimated that so much food is wasted every year, it could feed an entire football stadium full of people with very low standards about whether to eat garbage. Like the cast of Tenet, when confronted with an approaching news by date, we all wish we could turn back time. Well, what if there was actually a way that we could turn back time on news by dates? And what if I also told you it doesn't even require the ability to time travel, like Tenet? Whoa. But just to keep on waiting a bit longer, like Lord of the Rings Return of the King. See, I used to think that if you left some foods out for too long, they would spoil. But it turns out, this was a trick that rich people play on the common man to fool us into throwing away all our best cuts of meat. My ground shoveling away investigation into the elite restaurants and produce sellers of Melbourne has revealed exclusively and for the first time, what really happens when you leave food out and the esoteric science of meat alchemy or malchemy that's been kept from the world up to now. <laughs> 